Let's see. I think we have Tashina Lindley up next. Is that right? Yep. Tashina. Y'all are in for a treat. This is a playing woman right here. Let's see. Where's she hailing from these days? I need to be walking with my paper in my hand, I think. Hugo, Oregon. Is she coming through the Elvis store? There she is. Sorry about that. I haven't said hello to you yet. How are you Good doing, young lady? You. Good to see you, too. <laughs> Come up here. How you doing? Good to see you, too. Your, your little girl's already been up on stage about four or five times, I think. Yeah, she come, she come easing up through the Elvis door, too. But she is a national champion. Once a national champion, always a national champion, right? <laughs> All right, she's going to play Cattle and the Cane, and then she's going to follow it up with Say Old Man. Either way. <laughs> What do y'all think? She came hungry, didn't she? That's a hungry person right there. God. That was so good. You know, it's not fair, though. It's two against one on that. I know it. I'm I know it. Right. You think, there's a, you think there's a twin part in there baking? <laughs> okay. You going to do the sale, man, correct?
<laughs> and a girl. Woo! Ah, dang. That's setting the bar up here pretty high as far as I'm concerned. Doggone, Tashina. Mm. She must have a car payment or something. <laughs> Doggone. Well, next we have my buddy, Trustin. Come on up here, Trustin. <laughs> now, Trustin, how long have you been playing here at this contest? How many years have you been coming to it? I was going to say, because you're this is a former Forrest Craig fiddle winner right here. When he was first coming up here, he won that fiddle and, uh, and the freshman division. And then since then, you've, I know you've won the Grand Masters at least once, twice. He's, won a, he's a Grand Masters fiddle champion in Nashville twice. This is, a, this is a real deal right here, I'm telling you. But what have you done lately? <laughs> what have you done lately? <laughs> you judge the Grand Masters? Yeah, good for you. No, what are you going to play for us in the breakdown? Tom and Jerry, but trust in Baker. Y'all listen to this. Trusting, yeah, buddy. See, this is getting like this is the way I like it right here. Everybody's teeth are out. They're all looking real cross-eyed at each other. And it's a business. It's a business thing right now, isn't it? <laughs> I mean, business. <laughs> what you got for your second team, boss man? Uh, you're up next, right? Yeah, I just want to trade, huh? Dusty Miller. All right, he's gonna play Dusty Miller for a second team. Thank you. 
Had a boy, Tristan. Good job. Come on up here, buddy. It's time to play. You know, you know, even though even though Monty looks quite a bit older than me, we're actually the same age. Hey, what's your We've birthday? Been, uh, September tenth. What year? Uh, sixty-two. I'm October 1862. I'm a little younger. 1862, than I believe it. 1960. 1860. Just a month older. He's just a month older than me. <laughs> We've been buddies since we were like 12, hadn't we? Something like it. Something like that, yeah. We ain't fought but about three times. I, no. I lost every time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, buddy. You're from nowhere, Oklahoma, is that what that said? No water. No, not, not, oh, it's not nowhere, it's no water. Is that Cherokee for something? I have no idea. Everybody goes, you know, when you no say water. we're from no water, they go, no water? You know, no. like we've never heard that before. <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah, man. So you get to play too? Yeah, I know. I just fixed and bring that up. Oh. Actually, you want to? <laughs> okay. Yeah, you you're jumping the gun. Okay, I thought he did, wasn't going to let me know tell. Him. So he went, he traveled down to Athens, Alabama. I was shocked. And, I'm still in shock. And, and cleaned up on him down there and won the uh, Tennessee Valley Fiddle Championship down there, right at Athens. Yeah, man. I this, don't know how. This year, what? When was it? Last year, sometime. It was a blur. <laughs> well, we won't talk about how fast you drove down there. All right, so you get to play two of them. And I'm playing a fiddle I won at Winfield last year. You did? You won that at Winfield? God, that's a beautiful yeah, back. Yeah, this is my favorite thing. fiddle now. This is like a Glee Romanian violin. I love it, man. Got some, it's got some, guys, it's somebody, somebody had, they, they thought it had a little too much wood, didn't they? I guess. Carved you out some, some sight holes through it. All right, boss, break down? Yeah, we're going to do Gray Eagle. Monty Gaylord, Gray Eagle. Pretty, pretty clippy, but not just, you know, we're not, you know what I mean. find all these poor broke fiddle players man they're really trying to win something today what do you got for a second one do you have enough energy to play another one? we're gonna do sally johnson good, good luck being still buddy Thank you. 
<laughs> hey, Monty. I got buddy. That was good. <laughs> <laughs> well, he just doesn't have any feelings at all about his own fiddle playing, does he? Talk about wearing it on your sleeve and the floor and the socks and the carpet back here. <laughs> yeah, y'all give Monty another hand, man. That's a lot of work. That was an aerobic experience, wasn't it? That made me tired. I think I lost two pounds watching him. <laughs> what you gonna play, Alex? Sally Johnson. listen to because I want to listen to him too. He's, He's a little hungry too, yeah. Pre, pre touch of Texas. You, you got a foreclosure on your house or something? <laughs> What's going on with this? Where did this come from? That gone, man. That was awesome. Uh, yeah, Terry Moore. Terry, you been listening to Terry? Well, yes, sir. What's that? <laughs> yeah. That was really good, bud. That was really, I was really happy for that. Can you follow it up with something? I'll do Sally Gooden. I haven't heard that one. You're going to do the Sally's back to back, huh? Sure, yeah. All right. <laughs> Sally Gooden.
Thank you. <laughs> and you did that with only busting one hair. Paul, did you watch that? One hair. He only busted one hair. He's in eco mode on that bow, I think. <laughs> All right, next up we have Carrie Barbell from Salem, Salem, Ohio, Salem, Ohio. Rumor has it that you're the reigning Kentucky State champion. Is that and correct? Ohio. Huh? And What's Ohio that? And Ohio too? Yeah. Well, see, I, I don't have all the information to do it, but I got some of it. So for this year, 2024 years, Ohio and Kentucky and Kentucky. Anywhere else? No. All right, well, just checking. Well, that's, you get quite a resume built up there, young lady. All right, girl, you get to play two tunes, a breakdown and a choice. You have one already picked out, or you like maybe wake, walk up here and then try to decide right now? <laughs> Well, my husband said I should play Tom and Jerry. He said you could? He said I could. All right. Yeah. Well, I ain't going to stop that. <laughs> Carrie Barbell, Tom and Jerry. young lady awfully good now it's decision time right now you got like eight tunes you got to water it down to three and then water that down to one and the one's going to be don't let the deal go down
<laughs> That's Carrie Marble. Last year, Carrie was one of our judges sitting at that table now, so she knows what it feels like to be on that side and this side of the table. Carrie, thank you so very much. All right, who have we got up next? Oh, the great and famous. Edward Carnes, who puts on one of the greatest fiddle contests in the world. He puts on about three of them, actually. You have one, you have one the Grand Masters, of course, and you have one in Kentucky at... Uh, What's the one in Kentucky you put on? Twin Lakes National Fiddler. Twin Champions. Lakes National Twins Fiddler. Are certified. Is that the is that the Kentucky State Championship? No, I put that on in March. Yeah, you have the Kentucky State Championship. Yep. What town's that in? Owensboro. Owensboro. Bluegrass Museum and Hall of Fame. And then you put on the one. What you what was the other one? Twin Lakes National Twin Lakes. Fiddler Championship. We got some flyers out there. Yeah. Man, if y'all get a chance to go out there, that's such pretty country and it's good fiddle playing and Ed puts on a great contest. Well, and then you you'll have the Grandmasters again out there at the uh, at Belmont. At Belmont at, University. And uh, ooh, Labor Day. Labor Day weekend in September, okay? August 31 and September 1 in beautiful Nashville, Tennessee. This commercial brought to you that's by right, Wesson. By, by Ed and Wes. <laughs> free parking. There free you go. Admission. There you go. Free airfare. Well, not really that. Really part. good barbecue yeah. right around the corner from it, actually. Oh, yeah. That's good a good barbecue. place. Good well, barbecue. Ed, you get to play two whole tunes to start with. Hot dog. What are you going to do we for your first tune? We don't overachieve here, Wes. We're going to do Tom and Jerry at first tune. <laughs> Let me listen. Is that where you need it? Is that good enough? Okay, Tom and Jerry with Ed Carnes. Okay. Y'all ready? Good beat. bothering you at all buddy walk along John. walk along with your paper collar that, on that reminds me of my old friend norman <laughs> y'all ready
good, Ed. Let's see what we got next. We got Andrew Lynn. All right, Andrew. <laughs> All right, boss, what do you want to do first? Uh, I'll do Apple Blossom. You going to play Apple Blossom? Or right, is Andrew Lynn, y'all in for a treat? Andrew's playing man. Apple Blossom. Andrew. <laughs> Did you say you're going to play the horse ball spring? Really? <laughs> I'll, I'll say that back here so you don't get caught. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do? Uh, old, straw old straw bonnet? Yeah, we haven't heard that one today, Andrew. Good. Andrew's going to play the old straw bonnet. That's Andrew Lynn, everybody. He didn't drive all the way from Kentucky for nothing. <laughs> Good job, Andrew.